What's up? Space Monkey here and welcome back to another Weapons of Call of Duty and today we're going to talk about the M27 IAR. It is a light machine gun or a lightweight machine gun that is on Call of Duty Ghost. Those of you that are already familiar with Call of Duty Ghost, there is only four light machine guns in the game. And the M27 IAR is one of the four. If you wanted a very decent, lightweight machine gun to play with, and uh, you're bored with playing with all the other weapons in the game, this is one of the weapons that are, is a very good weapon to give a try, and uh, slap on your loadout and go cause some damage for the opposing team. It has very good long shot accuracy. As far as hip fire, it's pretty decent. Um, the rate of fire is actually pretty moderate. It's got pretty moderate recoil, which is not too bad. I mean, you know, you play with the gun long enough, you'll get used to that recoil. As far as double kills, triple kills, and bloodthirsties, um, it passes the bloodthirsty challenge. For those of you that are familiar with all my videos, uh, you know, I try to. Uh, at least achieve a bloodthirsty during gameplay with playing with the Pacific weapon that I'm talking about. Just to go to show that it's uh, not hard. It's pretty decent. Uh, you're doing pretty fairly well if you're actually getting bloodthirsties in your game. So you're not doing bad. This weapon also comes with uh, quite a few attachments like most of the weapons in the game you know you got thermal sights you got red dot sight you got a cog sight you got a couple other new type of attachments that are in the game that they introduced into the game but this is an all-around versatile weapon which means that you can uh, run and gun if you would like you slap on that rapid fire and uh, run and gun or you can nest, find you a nest somewhere, and nest, um, you know, protect the objectives. It's not a bad weapon to play with if you want to go and play on some domination. This is a very good weapon to use as far as uh, defending against your bases. If you haven't already given it a try, I would suggest to go ahead and challenge you to give it a try. Um, I'm pretty sure that you should be able to put a hole in the opposing team. And uh, like many of the other guns that you uh, see me play with in some of my videos, this is another gun that you should be able to melt the people once you see them and have them in your line of fire. It should not be too hard picking them off. Now this is a uh, really fun weapon to play with. I mean, it does have its flaws. You know, it's just like like all other lightweight machine guns or light machine guns or heavy weapons. Um, you know, they all have a uh, longer reload time than some of your other average weapons in the game. So you have to kind of like space out your shots and make them count uh, because you don't want to get caught in that reload time. You don't want to get caught reloading your weapon. And once again, this is the M27 IAR light machine gun on Call of Duty Ghosts. Once again, it's the Space Monkey, and thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's gameplay, and don't forget to smash that like button on the way out. And don't forget to subscribe, because there is more content on the way. I hope you enjoyed today's gameplay, and until next time, peace.